Okay, now that you have watched the intro video for this lab, <clears throat> the inquiry lab with the softball, the block of wood, and the metal pipe, I'm going to go through a, quick, a few quick things here to show you how exactly we should be measuring these things so that we uh, get as accurate a result as possible. So first off here in the procedures, it is showing us that we're starting with a block of wood. And it says, number one, take the rule at your table and measure the length in centimeters of the block of wood. So <clears throat> here's my block of wood. Actually, I'm going to put it up on its side like this. And I have my inches and centimeters on the ruler. Uh, this is science class. we got to be using our centimeters. And we are going to measure this. Now, we don't want to start from the end of this ruler to measure because these are worn. Okay, Or uh, maybe even on this side, you can see, see it's broken. These have been, been around the block a few times. So <clears throat> we want to move into a more accurate line, one that we know is still accurate. So I'm going to center this one on the edge of the block here. I'm then going to measure over. And I see, I'll say it's uh, 16.3. Okay, 16 centimeters and 3 millimeters. 16.3 centimeters. But I need to remember to minus this one I added down here. Okay, because if I had gone from the edge, I can clearly see it's only going to be 15 something. So I'm going to go back to my one, and I'm going to get a we'll say 16 or 16.3 minus one, 15.3. I'll then have to go on and measure the width, which is going to be this measurement, and then also the height, which is going to be this measurement. Remember, all that information is going to go in right here. Length, width, height. Please remember, measure in centimeters, not inches. We then have to do this calculation here. It's pretty simple. Volume equals length times width times height. So I can grab a handy dandy scientific calculator here and just simply multiply this number by this number by this number. And then I will have an answer here. And since this one was in centimeters, 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 my unit will be cubic centimeters or centimeters cubed. Okay, because I had centimeters three times. 